putting this here, putting this here. <sighs> There's a lot of shit over there to go through. Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Poncho here from Ponchesy Games. Now today's episode is going to be a little bit different. For a really long time, pretty much as long as I can remember, ever since I had a Super Nintendo or an NES and stuff like that, I've always wanted to play my games. A huge screen, maybe a movie screen or a projector, and I can't believe it's taken me so long <laughs> to put two and two together with my projector and my retro consoles. Now I went ahead and bought this huge switcher, an 8 port switcher for regular, you know, um, red, white, and yellow cables and stuff like that for my projector and I wanted to go ahead and put all my retro consoles as well as some 7th generation consoles, you know, hooked up to my projector in my living room. I started going through the paces of setting everything up and I said to myself, wait a second, I should be totally filming this. So I went ahead, got my GoPro, luckily it was charged, went ahead and stuck my head mount on, strapped it to my head and I started you know, setting it up and I wanted to go ahead and share that process with you. And instead of making like this huge, long, lengthy video of this is what I'm doing, I'm, ho I'm hooking the stuff up right now. I just went ahead and, you know, edited everything with a bit of music in the background and, you know, wanted to bring this video to you. Now, um, as you can see right here, I had to buy this huge long cable. It's 25 feet long and it runs along the entirety of my entire living room. And I want to go ahead and get, you know, carpet, you know, later down the line to hide it because there's also another HDMI port that runs from that entertainment center, which you see right here, all the way to the other side of the wall where my projector is mounted. And, you know, <laughs> it's just really ugly there. And now, as you can see right here, I actually have it hidden behind this huge Pacific Rim poster. So besides the Pacific Rim poster looking really, really badass, it also hides my HDMI cable, the power cable to the projector and other stuff like that, which is really, really, really awesome. Now later on down the line, I do want to get some proper equipment for cable management, but for now this poster is going to have to do. So as you can see, there's just a whole bunch of ports in the background. And what I'm doing right here is I'm just going to go ahead and test out really quick if they actually work. And as you can see, the switcher works great. I booted on my N64. Everything looked awesome. So I'm just going to go ahead and start hooking everything back up. So as you can see, I'm going to go ahead and start hooking up all my consoles, which include my Sega Dreamcast, my Nintendo Wii, which I pretty much use for GameCube games because my regular GameCube is in my room. I have my Nintendo, my Super Nintendo, my N64, as well as my PS2. And while I was filming this video, I actually found my Hey You Pikachu N64, so that was another perk. Now I'm just wrapping everything up, making sure everything works. The Super Nintendo works great. Next up is the NES, that looks awesome. Right next up to that is the Nintendo Wii, and that looks great. The N64 is working flawlessly. Next to the Dreamcast, while it is still pretty loud, works great. And last but not least is my regular PS2, and that works awesome. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed the video. If you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, just go ahead and let me know in the comments below, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Have a good one.